Helm, you're not thinking of jumping into the sea, are you? You look like you're up to something. The signal is fairly far off. I think it would be a good idea to go in and examine it further. What? No! Why do you keep... it. That's the sound I've been hearing all day long. What? You've been hearing this infernal racket all day long? Wait, what is that? Are those tentacles? <gasps> Everyone, hide! <laughs> uh, is everyone okay? Me too. I'm okay here. <sighs> Kraken. Move! Greenhorn, get back! Oh my god. Is it... an island? A rapture. <sighs> Where'd it go? At any rate, we bought ourselves some time. Commander! Where are you? Master! Commander! Thank goodness we found you in time. Praise be to the heavens! Did you all feel those vibrations? You bet we did. And that sound! It was like nails on a chalkboard! What on earth was it? Was it in an earthquake? No. That was no earthquake. That was a rapture! What? Let's head inside the villa for now. We're right at the water's edge, and it's getting dark. It's dangerous here. Right. Let's head back. Wait. Helm, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. You're so not okay! You're limping! Why are you always so reckless? Mary! Yes? I think Helm hurt her leg. Take a look at it once we're inside. I will. You don't need to. Just shut up and hurry! Wait, no, I mean, go slowly. Thankfully, she wasn't seriously injured. I didn't see any damaged parts. Still, I think it'd be best for her not to move around so much. I'm sorry. I'm the only one here who can swim. I should have been more careful. If you knew that, why the hell didn't you just stay put? Why'd you take off running like that? Anise, you shouldn't talk to a patient like that. She's not taking care of herself. <sighs> Fine, let's just leave it. More importantly, what was that thing back there? I can't say for certain. But if it's what I think it is, it's a marine rapture, known as the Kraken. Kraken? A sea-based rapture? It's the first time I've heard of it. That doesn't surprise me. The last time anyone saw it was over a hundred years ago. It's a tyrant-class rapture. It claimed the lives of countless seafarers in the past. So much so, that it was called the Black Hole of the Sea. My god! If this thing's been dormant for so long, 
What made it reappear? From my understanding, the reason most sea-based raptures disappeared had to do with their power sources. Operating underwater is a power-intensive process, and Kraken's power source is the most intense of them all. It's a lumbering giant that constantly needs power, in an environment where there's little to be found. As a result, it's been lying dormant on the ocean floor for all these years. That would be my best guess, yes. Hmm... I only rerouted some electricity to a small hydroelectric plant nearby. It shouldn't have been nearly enough to bring that mammoth monstrosity back to life. Weird. <laughs> we can figure out the details later. Commander, if this thing truly is a tyrant class, there's nothing we can do right now. The only reason we're still here is that, for whatever reason, it didn't attack us and instead went back into the water. I suggest we leave this island right now. Wait. The signal stopped moving. What a Nikkei detective can do! signal appears to have stopped here. That's... Beside the road heading back to the mainland! That's where the Kraken is? Hmm... There's still a fair bit of distance between the sea road and the signal. We'll move quietly. If the signal starts to move again, we'll pull back right away. Roger! Helm, are you okay? Yes. I won't drag you all down. Don't worry. <sighs> no reaction yet. Maybe it's sleeping. I'm glad. Everyone, keep your head on a swivel. Aw, oh, crap. Did we wake it? Everyone stay still. once again. The body is somewhere far off. Only the appendages are focused on this area. Those tentacles must be miles long. Oh. Could it be? Everyone, stay here for a bit. I'm going in alone. 
Be that as it may, someone has to do something. I'm already injured, so it makes the most sense for me to go. What kind of logic is that? That's screwed up! If someone has to act as bait, it'd be better for someone wounded to go, rather than someone who's healthy. I also know more about the Kraken than any of you do. Let me do this. Ugh. Do what you must. It pains me as a doctor to let you do this. The second you feel something isn't right, you fall back, okay? I understand. I appreciate your concern. This is meant to be a warning. And if I go further... This is bad. We're trapped here. Figures. As soon as we pass the halfway mark, the tentacles show up. One step further, and they start to attack. Given their size, it would be next to impossible to evade these things and get to the other side. Oh boy. We're in big trouble. Hmm. The only thing I don't understand is... Why is it keeping us here? About one week. It's already been one day, so that gives us five or six days before we're well and truly trapped. Food supplies are also a concern. We didn't take many rations with us since we thought we'd be in and out of here. Wait! We have litter! What's preventing us from doing what we did before? We can just build a boat like before and cross. Why do we have to use this pathway? Hey! You're right! You guys make it seem as if I can pull these creations out of thin air! No, that won't work this time. The situation isn't the same. I'm not sure how sturdy that boat was. But if the Kraken happens to attack us while we were crossing, we would all drown. She's right. It's far too dangerous. But that Kraken has parked itself there and doesn't seem like it's gonna move. If we just sit here and twiddle our thumbs, we really will be trapped. Sleep... forever? Don't cheat us! The first thing we need to do is get in touch with the Ark. Perhaps they can help us formulate a plan to escape this island. <laughs> 